So for this drill, we're going to be working on ankle dorsiflexion. I want you on a raised surface, could be a book, something with your toes that are hanging off the edge. This is going to help prevent us from gripping our toes down into the floor. When we do that, we put too much tension in the foot. What we want is to allow for those little bones of the foot to start gliding and uh, going into different ranges of motion that we've probably lost. Okay, so to start, all we're doing here is driving our knee forward over our big toe, our second toe, and then all the way down, trying to drive our knee in line with each toe as far as we can, focusing not to start gripping our toes and not letting our heel come off the platform either. After that, our next one is going to be where we're going to take this other foot, we're going to bend down through the knee and touch the wall in front of us, and then bend down, touch behind us. Touch the wall in front, behind, trying to keep the knee in line with the big toe or the second toe. Again, we can do about 15 to 20 reps of this here. Making sure not to hinge forward like that, but we want all of it to come from the knee, going over our toes. Same thing on the way back. Okay, and then further that distance from the wall with the more range of motion that we get in our knee. Again, focusing not to grip our toes or flex our toes in the ground. And for the last one, from here, what we're doing is we are bending and twisting. So we're opening up through there like that. Again, letting that knee come forward, we're using the wall for some support. Just like that. Okay. Again, we're working on ankle dorsiflexion through these movements here.